What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I want to talk about the font, uh, the business name font on your invoice. What I'm talking about is when you print the invoice, there's the font only I'm talking about the font for your business name. Uh, so we already had a font, but you gotta download it by going on VIP Shop Management. Let me do this real quick. If you go to VIP Shop Management, click on Downloads, and all the way where it says Additional Downloads, um, there's there's a font right there, and we have we just added a new font. It's called Recharge. Um, it's really cool and made for this type of stuff. Where it's uh, let me zoom in right here. If you don't have any of these, um, you need to download them. But if you want the first one. So basically, if you download the recharge, you will override this one. And uh, we're gonna talk about this. How to download, let me show you how to download. If you click on just, let's say I wanna download this one. You just open it and there's an install button. So it's really simple. And that's the font of the, the one we're using right now uh, for, your, uh, for your business. If you didn't download it, it's gonna go back to the default, which is the basic. So if you don't want your business name on the invoice right here um, to look basic, um, definitely download the one of these fonts or actually download both fonts. Um, the new one right now is called Recharge. Uh, one of my customers told me about it. And um, it looks really cool. I mean, I usually don't play with the fonts much, but it looked uh, really cool. So. Uh, you can use it, it's called Recharge. Just all you have to do is click on download, like I said, and it's gonna download and then click on install. It takes seconds, and that's how it looks like. Uh, it looks pretty cool. Uh, it makes your business name pop, pop up and uh, on the invoice right here. So I'm gonna zoom in real quick, see how would that look like. So if you look, let me see if we put the hand. So you see how it looks like, it's a lot better. Man, I'm loving this uh, PDF uh, preview. So yeah, if you guys are interested and you wanna change the font, uh, we don't have a way of selecting your own font. Maybe at some point we'll make that happen. Uh, but as of right now, I mean, we have, we've tried them all. So don't think like, oh my God, I'm gonna use this font and it's gonna look good. Not really. Uh, there's very few fonts for headers for displaying your business name. Very few. There's not good, you cannot, if you use Time Romans, it's not gonna do it. Um, Arial, it's not gonna do it. It's gonna look, it doesn't look good. And uh, this happens usually if you don't have any of these fonts installed. Um, yeah, basically it's gonna go to the default and that's why you're seeing your business name in just plain text. Uh, so uh, go ahead and download. You can try the recharge. If you don't like the recharge, you gotta uninstall it. Uh, to uninstall the, the font, just type in font settings and just find the font and click on install so you can uninstall any font do not play with the original font um, just only uninstall whatever you install and you don't like in this case recharge so don't try to uninstall it that would cause problems later on so yeah um, with the users uh, for the customers who are using um, already the old change pr uh, printer so this header font is already installed automatically basically this font gets installed when you install the old chain sticker. If you don't have the old chain stickers, meaning you need to come in here and install this font, or you can install, I say I definitely suggest installing both fonts. Um, if you don't like the recharge, then uninstall it and go back to the original, which is, uh, we already talked about this. Um, look like this. Everything matters, all the small, tiny stuff makes things look really cool and so. So yeah, that's the new, I saw it um, on the invoice itself after I print it. And it definitely look uh, really nice and unique. 
and the, the A it's kind of really cool I think it looks really nice with the caps too let me check it out see how that look like to remove the you see it auto capitalized the header if you want to if you uncheck this box you can type it VIP I know some people like to do that ink and let's see how would that look like um, let's go back to print preview yeah even the caps that's what I was talking about the caps of it actually looks even nicer uh, it looks beautiful so yeah you might have to change it to capital letter I'm gonna actually print that one and check it out later so yeah this is all about fonts uh, make sure you download the fonts if you like them um, that's it for today until next time thanks for watching